Alright, that's it for the Rim Trail, Mather Point to Bright Angel Trailhead. Length is 6 miles, elevation gain 413 feet, ride type is and out and back. The Rim Trail, again, is a little over 12 miles when all is said and done, so this is a piece of that. I think this is probably one of the more common pieces of that trail. A lot of folks like to hike out. Uh, Bright Angel is actually like a 15 mile hike, but I know a lot of people that will do like bits and pieces of it versus just all 15 miles. I'll link to that trail if you guys are interested in the description down below. Those are the trail details, dogs on leash, which is weird. Um, I guess you, you a lot of dogs. Kid friendly, yes. Wheelchair friendly, very. Paved, stroller friendly. Really meant for anyone and everyone, right? That's that's the way public land should be. And the description here, I'll copy bits and pieces of it are great. I'll put it up on the description below just in case anybody decides to edit and remove some of this really great information. Quickly covering how to get here specifically for this trail, you'll start at the visitor center, huge parking lot, very easy to find. And then from there, you'll start making your way west. So you head up to Mather Point and then make your way west to Bright Angel Trailhead. Very easy in terms of finding parking. All right, let's talk about additional trail details. So I'm gonna use all trails here. Number one, Mather Point. For many visitors, this is their first view of the Grand Canyon. It's a pretty good one. Closest viewpoint from the park entrance, even though there are better views further along the rim trail. Basically this part here, right? It's like no effort, magnificent views. 
Mather Point. Right next to that, a little bit northwest, you see the Grand Canyon, a little snapshot. You'll want to keep making your way up to the Yavapai Geology Museum. Really cool spot. Based on the sign, what it says is that it is, from a geological perspective, the best view of the Grand Canyon um, is at the Yavapai Geology Museum from inside there. You'll keep making your way past Grandeur Point all the way over to Ver Camp's Visitor Center, and that's they have little shops and stuff, and that's really kind of the the entrance to the Grand Canyon Village. The Grand Canyon Village has a lot of shops, restaurants, a lot of stuff you can find there. And really you'll want to keep going all the way to Mary Jane Coulter Lookout. Pretty interesting to get some views from there. And then you finish off at Bright Angel Trailhead. If you're coming to the Grand Canyon, especially for the first time, this is a magnificent trail. And even though it's six miles, if you plan to get on the bus, what you could do is do the three mile one way and then basically get on the blue line, shuttle back to the visitor center. So you could turn that into a three mile so you don't have to go back the same way. You just did a magnificent, magnificent three mile hike. Easy with great views. So stick around, I'll see you guys next week.